Hi all, welcome to our mission board community. So today I'm just inviting to Sai. Sai recently got multiple offer letter and he moved from an internal to the data in their side. I know personally Sai putting a lot of effort. Maybe Sai words can uh, like and motivate others. Sai, are you there? Yeah, yeah, Devi, I'm here. Uh, good afternoon, Devi. Good afternoon, Sai. Uh, firstly, I want to thank you uh, so much for all the guidance and support. It is not like a one-time support. It was continuous guidance and continuous support throughout the uh, duration. Is like uh, not able to explain what's to be honest. That much helpful it was totally. Thanks, thanks, thanks from, the, also. from the day one to, I mean, till cracking the job and getting multiple offers, even though after getting multiple, I mean, even though getting offers, one or two, still uh, asking to uh, prepare more and get the high package and all so that is like uh, more motivation because we always need a person to uh, guide us in a situation because uh, i came from uh, initially from a qa background then internally i i learned and i switched to data engineering even though i switched but i, I lack of many uh, cloud skills azure and all so I searched for more than some three to four months uh, for a good uh, community, for good training. So luckily I found a, a vision board and a mentor like you and I joined a vision board. And thanks, thanks for your words also because this much of time you search and find that, right? So thanks for your word also. <laughs> yeah, Devi. Uh, and your uh, revision, I mean, uh, the materials that you provide uh, from day one uh, which can which contains everything actually to be very honest those are very th th those are 90 percent enough in most of the cases that uh, that uh, that is enough i mean for real time also that is most useful in our daily life challenges and also for interview purpose also those materials are very useful so mm -hmm. before half an hour or before one hour sometimes we we might in a situation to face the interview within one hour hr will call and uh, will you available in uh, in another half an hour or another one hour so at that time this material was very helpful which helped to revise all the concepts from end to end concepts from for azure data factory or data bricks and uh, sql python pyspark everything they will Sai, one more thing. For example, you told me, right, you are coming from an internal tool. I, I know personally, like, some kind of struggle would be there. So, yeah. how much time you invested for learning and tracking this much of offers? Uh, before joining uh, Vision Board, uh, I took six months to prepare uh, mm -hmm. to get into the track. Mm -hmm. And after joining uh, Vision Board also, uh, it's almost uh, some more than four to six months I took to to because to understand uh, to concepts all the concepts uh, uh, in in the du uh, entire duration of the batch and then starting giving apparently I started giving the interviews but uh, if getting the first offer letter is more struggle right. Uh, exactly, getting the first offer letter because we need building the confidence also, right? Building the yeah. confidence, attending multiple interviews. That is also the main part of the journey. Yeah. They... And uh, like, and for example, Sai, how was the market when you attending? Like, recently you attended, right? In 2020. Yeah. So how is the market actually? After I think we modified the resume, you got some kind of extra calls. Yeah. Initially so, also, uh, initially when joined a uh, vision board. I'm not able to get many calls. I'm not able to search the position, but uh, some uh, in your trainings only you will be guiding how to modify Naukri page, how to modify the resume, how and how to and what are the certification we need to do and add into our resume. Even though you also help me help us to uh, modify the LinkedIn and how to search for jobs. So then after I realized like. I, I, when I was uh, giving interviews uh, recently, I feel for data engineers is the most demand and having many positions. 
many positions rather compared to any development projects also let's say java or other things also there are not much openings i feel for data engineers there are very main i mean lot of openings are there and luckily in hyderabad also many gc sirs are came and they are mm-hmm. recently started hiring many many for many roles actually mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. i think a lot of companies are uh, uh, there in the hyderabad right yes. i got the yeah. information there are still the hiring people also yeah okay and one more thing sir like an a if we have uh, some some people i think resume building section in our linkedin profile is one of the mandatory step to getting our landing or job so yeah. like i just want to tell you how the interview like and how many rounds are there how the process would be looks like yeah in most of the some of the cases are uh, some companies are having assessment mm-hmm. first uh, first round of mcq assessment then coding assessment then technical interview then manager interview then hr interview uh, so there are four or three rounds will be there right yeah yeah there okay first round would be coding means which language yeah they are uh, giving questions on multiple one one is pyspark python sql so anything we can choose right anything yeah i mean uh, in one of the case they asked to solve uh, five questions uh-huh. uh, three from pyspark one from python one from sql mm. but they mainly focusing on pyspark and sql mm-hmm. the optimization is i mean more mm-hmm. about optimizing data engineers need to work on more right in the data yeah. Uh, and yeah. pyspark and different that's why they are asking this kind of question yeah, and coming into the like any other like question what you remember right from your mind if you want to prepare or some kind of specific question you want to share with people yeah when coming to azure part the most uh, asking question was how to uh, extract data from different multiple sources mm. uh, the etl extraction and how to connect to sql database the connection part and uh, basic questions like how many uh, integration run times are there uh, and also how how you connect uh, azure data factory to data bricks uh, the mm-hmm. mounting part how how you load the data and how you schedule the jobs and what how many types of schedulings are there in azure data factory or data bricks mm-hmm. and uh, uh why i mean using pyspark uh, rather than scala or other oh. languages so mm-hmm. and what what is a job cluster this is also main question the okay. type of uh, cluster that you are using because uh, type of cluster depends on the cost and uh, uh, i mean it totally uh, depends on the cost factor so how you optimize the i, I in all the interviews i feel uh, i mean like not writing about the code mm-hmm. writing the optimized code is a i mean more uh, uh, what i can say more applicable factor because mm-hmm. we need to write the code in a more i mean more optimized way then only uh, interviews interviewer will be happy because everyone will write the code but it should be very optimized and very under- easy to understand and mm. should be should concise one so they they will be also checking that part right these days yeah okay, mm-hmm. okay. and like uh, one more thing sir in the manager rounds also is it tough how it will be looks like like a um, tough or what if fail uh manager role is is fine they i mean it is more about uh, our uh, uh our approach to the question mm-hmm. our response our communication one of the question they ask like uh, let's say there is a ba person coming into the picture or non stakeholder non technical person is coming then how you will explain that these technical terms to them okay. like that okay. so uh, i on that time i thought something and i del- i try to deliver in the most uh, uh, reliable way mm. so this is all about the instant instant one and sometimes we they, in linkedin they will post some of the questions behavioral questions and mm. interview questions and mm. if in if we read about the articles about how to solve the problem problem solving skills approaches so this will be helpful it, it is not like practicing uh, i mean not about by hearting or remembering something it's all about practicing so that it will be useful in any time oh, okay great 
Yeah, and one more thing, sorry, like I'm, uh, I think when the people are at the last question, I think when the people are preparing, so any kind of advice or any kind of words you want to share with them? Uh, yeah, I feel like uh, one is uh, keep on reading, I mean, keep on learning the things. Uh, I mean, sometimes uh, it will be take time to uh, track. Uh, I mean, crack any interviews, but uh, if I mean, start applying to many positions, start sending mails to the recruiters, mm -hmm. apply on the Naukri, uh, uh, update the Naukri profile daily, and uh, search for the keywords in LinkedIn. So we'll get the post daily job post. Send the mail, apply in the LinkedIn. Go to the walk-ins. If you go to the walk-ins, it will be more useful because. Oh. There are different types of questions will be evolving around us. Mm -hmm. So many people will be coming and coming out. So we'll be also having friends at that time. So mm -hmm. we can communicate with them and and uh, and uh, get the questions from them also. Okay. So this is all about continuous learning. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, then. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think your words will be really helpful to the people. And the team, uh, whatever Sai is sharing, right? That is kind of an amazing technique. Please follow who are preparing for the interview. There are many more openings. I, in our group also, you can see, right, 100 plus job openings are there, uh, posting like in yes. your team members. Yes. That much of openings are there. Recruiters are also searching for talent people. So we need to build our profile. We need to be specialized on our expertise. Definitely, job will be there. Yeah, and one more thing I want to say is, for every, uh, I mean, every tech stack, I mean, for the Azure Data Factory, you are bringing one person, Aishwarya. She was also very helpful, very explained. And uh, PySpark, uh, you also explained PySpark, Python, those thoughts are very useful. You directly showed in the live how to execute the queries and you gave time to execute and ask the questions. And Krishna also for Databricks. So he, every, uh, new skill was introduced by a new person, so it is easy to learn from each one because different people having different ideology, exactly. so it is easy to uh, mingle with them. Mm -hmm. okay. And in our community also, everyone was very hungry for job hunting, so yes, exactly. that is helpful because if you are surrounded by the people having the same mindset, then mm -hmm it will be helpful because they are also posting the questions and getting the answers resolved. Mm -hmm. Yes, I, that will be really nice for your thought also. Thanks for your time. I can understand like I'm busy Sunday, but always thankful to, grateful to you to share with your information. Yeah, the, your guidance was one of the main pillars for my uh, uh, achieving my offer later. I, I was you. telling this from my bottom of my heart. I mean. <laughs> Thank you, Sam. Thank you so much. Thank you, Devi. Thank you so much.